So let's say if you wanna, let's say you wanna, you're in a tight spot, you wanna take off. So yeah. drop it down to two real quick. You hear boom, drop it down one more. See how it's all the way up? Now you just take off, hit the gas. Yeah, yeah, and then go up. I have a sports yeah. car. Yeah. Revel on your own on a bed to bed to bed to trip. You ready? <laughs> All right, so what's up, everybody? It's your boy Q. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a good morning, day, evening, night, whatever time it may be that you're watching this video. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for being here. And since you're here, I got a good one for y'all today. I got a special guest with me. Say hey, Nikita. Hey, so Nikita is a family, a part of our family, of course. You've probably seen it in some of my other videos. Um, so this actually is her custom built. Hi, baby. 2018 IS300. <laughs> so that's what we're going to talk about today. Let's go. It's already right here. You can see it on the badge. Yes. F Sport right there. So we're going to do a quick walk around the car. So okay. first thing I noticed, Kita, is the color. Yes. I love the flakes of the yes. car you guys can see. So Yes, so the color is called Caviar. Okay. And um, I'm not really a girly girl, but when I saw this paint color in person, yep. um, one, I like black. But it was like the sparkles, the glitter. Yeah. I'm like, oh, I love yeah, this. I'm I telling, have to have this. And you got, I'm telling you, I look better in person than it does on camera. You can see it so, looks yeah. amazing. I it, love it. So came to the other side to give you all a better picture of the car. So you probably can see the flakes a little better on this side as opposed to the other side. But yeah, so I love the color. I agree with that. You said what's the color again? It's called caviar. 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 Love the caviar color. Moving down, you also have these are 18 inch alloy wheels. They look very nice i love the uh how many spokes is this one two three four five six seven eight nine. like 10 spoke wheel yep. looks very lexus, good you know emblem in the middle gotta have a lexus emblem. you yeah, know what it is like you pulling up <laughs> yeah so those are nice they got some super actually super thin tires on it kind of give it which is the f sport model yes. which means the tires are going to be a little thin a little more sporty um look which i do love coming around here to the front end so i know we talked about some things on the front end yes so one of the things that I really loved about the uh, 2018 Lexus um, IS model uh -huh. was the grill and yeah. the changes that they did with the lights. It's just so smooth, sleek, sexy. Yep. I love that the grill drops all the way to the bottom. So yep. it really just kind of spoke to me. When I saw it, I was like, I got to <laughs> have it. I'm going to be honest with you, I agree with Nikita on this. If you look at this grill, man, I mean, this grill looks super aggressive. Like when you see it coming down, I see, I seen this car at night a few times when we've been out. And from behind, it looked like something just want to eat you up, yes. run you over. But it looks super aggressive. I love what they did with the grill. It kind of makes the car look wide, actually. If you look at get down here on my level, it kind of makes oh, the car yeah. look wide in the front. Uh, but do love that. And also, we just saw this. I'm going to show you here in a second. This actually lights up, this whole LED strip. So this is your actual light, light housing here. But this lights up. Does this turn yellow? Um, no, it's white. It does turn white. So, so I don't know. When I turn on my blinker, maybe yeah. we can test it out. I, we can. You know, I'm always in my car. Right. So I don't know what it looks like to others on the outside. I just right. know I feel good when I'm riding in it. So. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So I, I don't know. I don't think it does, but I never noticed it was an LED strip right here. I, yeah. I think that's super dope. Now I got a question for you. Yes. In Texas, it's required yes. to have a front plate. You ever got a ticket for not having a front plate? I have not gotten a ticket, <laughs> and I honestly took. They had the little plate there, and uh -huh. I just felt like it took away from the front it of my does. car. It does. So I'll just gamble on that. Yep. Um. So yeah, there will not be a front plate on the front. Of my <laughs> I'm with you. I can do the same thing on red. It's just it. <laughs> like you said, the front plate would just make this look. No, off. it would just make the whole thing look off. Yeah, I, agree with you I didn't like it. Yeah, I didn't like that either. But also, you go down here, you got some aerodynamic stuff here, you know. So, this is a hole as well. Pretty sure that's a fuel efficiency, efficiency, excuse me. And then I think this is just, oh, this is grilled out, meshed out as well. So, that way basically allows air to flow through the car, makes it more aerodynamic. So, it's funny how they hide all these little quirks and features in yeah. this car. You really got to get in. So, also here at the top, you see, got your camera, camera right here. So, for your you said it comes with adaptive cruise control? Um, no. Yeah, it has like this um, safety feature where uh -huh. if you're driving and you start to veer off in another lane, yep. then there's like this autocorrect um, technology. Yeah. Um, oh, so 
<laughs> I hate to admit this, but sometimes I text and drive. <laughs> and so, you know, she didn't just say that. I'm <laughs> sorry. I'm working on it. I'm a work in progress. Yeah. <laughs> but um, this camera really comes in handy. Uh -huh. um, it, there's a feature if I get too close to a car or if it notices based off of my speed yeah. and, you know, if the car in front of me is stopped, it'll send like a, a signal and it'll say uh -huh. brake, like okay. across my uh, windshield, yeah. across my dashboard. Oh, really? Just okay. alerting me like, hey, brake, look up. Yeah. So it's flashed a couple of times. <laughs> um, but I'll do better. <laughs> she be she, look, 2019 go. Stop texting the driver. Look, make sure y'all. That's y'all Q-tip. Stop texting the driver. And that was your Q-tip of the day. So we gonna go ahead and move on to the interior. Basic. I gotta go ahead to the trunk. Go ahead. Basic trunk. Um, one of the biggest things that I love again is the storage. Um, it's really nice. I love the storage. Yeah. Um, it's really nice. It's it, the brand is very big on safety. Yep. Um, I thought it was really cool that I got it. It comes with the first aid kit. That's dope. I mean, you that know, dope. it's the little things, right? Yeah. <laughs> that dope. I'm like, I don't know if I got it. So then here's your tire, your yeah. spare tire. Yeah, everything kit, I need, kit. you know. Yeah. I'm yeah, a country but... girl, so if I ever do have a flat, I mean, I have insurance. Someone can always come yeah. and do it. Yeah. But I know how to change my, you know, my own tire. you know how to change tire. your own tire? I got well, it. you can come change mine. Save me, Look, I don't know how to do mine. See, you know what? I ain't got big red, though. That's a big, <laughs> that's a big tire. <laughs> but actually, be honest with you, man, this is a very deep trunk. I'm going to be like, yeah. it go way back. and got yeah. Oh. Water bottom. <laughs> Appreciate it. You're but good. yeah, this actually is a very deep trunk. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I didn't think it was this big back here, but very deep trunk. They fall down? Yeah, they do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So down. if you see, need to, like, yeah, you can see there. Long. That's how you fall down. Yeah. Okay, cool. All right, so right. as you can see, guys, I'm in the back seat now. So again, not a lot of room back here for somebody my size. I mean, I'm 6'2, like I said, but I'm not uncomfortable. But you can see my head room, and I'm sure you can see the kitty if you see my head. Uh, oh, not too much room. Can you see it that way? Yeah, you know. <laughs> so you can see my head room. No? Yeah. No headroom. No headroom. So, I mean, it's a little headroom. It's not bad, but also you can see. So, my knees are not touching the back seat at this point, but you can see how the seat is up front, how far up it is as well. So, you can get an idea of how much room you had in the front in order for me to fit back here comfortably. So, again, this is not the biggest car in the world. It's not designed for that, and we all know that. But me sitting back here, if I was like this, I'm fine. You know, I have ridden back here before, actually behind Nikita. So, uh, I wasn't uncomfortable at all, but. Like I said, you know what you're getting with this. You're not getting a minivan. We all know this is not a minivan. So just keep that in mind. <clears throat> okay. Oh, you guys. So moving on to the interior. So you can see right here, first thing we got, we got power seats. Yes. Uh, on both driver and passenger side, Which right? I love. That's always a plus. Also, I, I just noticed this, kind of going out of order here with the pedals. Are these custom as well? Um, yeah, so that comes oh. with the F Sport. That's one of the features. So the F Sport head gets the more sporty looking pedals, which I do. I like, I like that touch. So can I talk to you about the yeah. leather? So one of the things that I was a little disappointed in yeah. um, was the color, color of the leather. So I really wanted a leather color that kind of popped when okay. it was up against the black. Mm -hmm. And so they had this color. I don't remember what it was called, but it was kind of like a burnt orange. Okay. And I really thought that it would just be fly, right? Right, right. Yeah. Well, so at the time when I was building my vehicle, it wasn't available as an option. Ah. Uh, so I had to go with this kind like of a like white it. stone look. Yeah. And you know, it still looks it still good. Looks good. Yeah, it does. But it's like I can't wear dark jeans, oh, like yeah, you know, because it'll yep. bleed over. Yep. So I still want my like darker leather interior. So <laughs> yeah. moving, you know, moving forward, my next Lex Lexus vehicle, I'll go with a darker leather. You know um, what a lot of people do too? Red. 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 Interior, so yeah, yeah. you know, a lot of the a lot of my um friends that drive Alexis and they have mm -hmm. the F Sport, they have the red interior. I'm just not a red interior. Really? No. Red kind of sets it all. To uh -huh. me personally, red kind of sets it all. It takes a whole. I new like level. just clean, classy. Okay. Yeah, you I know. see. That. I feel you. Okay. Yeah, because red definitely is like a like yeah. a pop yeah. standout color when for you get sure. the interior. For sure. All right, so I'm gonna climb up in here real quick. All right. Okay. I tried to. <laughs> <laughs> It is I a little tight. Hold on, hold on. We're going to let the seat back a little bit. You're a bigger guy. <laughs> I am. This is, this is a car, you know, built for me. Right, it is. So, oh, we go. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I should have flipped it around. But anyway. It's okay. <laughs> All right, guys. So, we in the car, as you can see. So, again, I'm 6'2", and you can see me and Q almost touch the shoulders right now. Right. All right, so... No, this is probably not a car for a big person like myself, but it's not meant for that. I mean, we all know this car is not meant for big people. But uh, looking at the interior, we're going to go over the interior really quick. All right, guys, so moving over to the steering wheel, you have your mode selector, I'm pretty sure. So that's how you toggle through your switches up here. 
Um, so mm -hmm. this is to toggle on the right side is to toggle through my switches. Up oh, there. this is okay. Yeah, see, that's why it's not my car. It's okay. About. This one's for like um, music control, so I can okay. choose my modes from Bluetooth, radio, okay. auxiliary, things of that nature. Okay. Of course, we've got the um, phone controls. Yeah, you can. I can talk to my vehicle and ask it to find directions to X, Y, and Z. Call okay. whoever. So, so I really do. Yeah, I do like that uh, aspect of the vehicle. Uh, these buttons again. Um, so this is your lane departure button yep. and your, uh, I guess, adaptive cruise control. And this is we for like my uh, dashboard when I want to go into F-Sport mode. Okay, so we're going to show them that here. All right, guys, so it is push to start. So let's go ahead and start it up. Put your foot on the brake. Oh. See the dash there? I'm not going to lie. This is probably one of the dopest dash I have ever seen. It's actually almost kind of futuristic in my opinion. Do you, I love it. Yeah. What do you like about it? I mean, it just... So one of the uh, distinguishing features yeah. is that when I push this little button, right. um, the uh, dashboard actually moves so a little circle. Ahead, so when I saw that, I was like, yeah. this is fly. It's like I'm about to take off. It's like it's the wings. Where the wings get? The wings right. came out yet. The wings. You know what I'm saying? Take so I'm show y'all that again. So I press it, I press it again and it goes yeah. back, right? Yeah, so it'll go back. Press this button here. Yep. Go back. And then you push it again. And it just kind of gives you a different so it's just a view. different layout view yeah so oh, that's pretty cool oh, that's pretty that's cool. how you so, can, can kind of go through. ah yeah. so there's your lane departure on off that's pretty cool i would yeah. drive it like this how do you drive you use it like this so it depends on my mood okay. if i'm in like ratchet you know mode <laughs> then i'll have it you know to the right like trap music going like can't nobody say nothing yeah. to me but if i'm like cool calm and collective yeah, we'll keep it regular okay okay that's, like the, that's, that's actually pretty cool i don't know if i ever seen any other car do that with the the dash whatever yeah, you want movement moves that's pretty dope yeah and so we move over here so you can see here you have your this is actually a nice big screen to be honest with y'all it's hard to see in person uh, so you can just go through it. So one of so, the things that I, mm -hmm. I, again, and not to, I love my vehicle, but one of the things that was kind of like a, a downer for me right. was the fact that it's not touchscreen. Yep, I agree um, with that. I, you know, I, Lexus is very big on safety, so mm -hmm. I guess, you know, maybe they did some type of pilot or case study and people chose to goal or whatever but right. per personally i would prefer to just have a touch screen because yeah. everything else in my life is touch screen so it yep. makes sense yep. um but we have to use this toggle to move around right. and you know make my selection if i don't want to use the toggle then of course you have the voice command which okay. you know is uh also um convenient right. but Okay. You know, that's all, that's my only piece. Of yeah, and I agree because I mean, Lexus, come on, man, it's 2019. I everything know. we use is touchscreen from I phones, know. everything. And I mean, I get what they were going from, like the mouse. I mean, you yeah. know, I can use mouse that works. I get it, but it's I mean, it's okay to have this feature, but you know, also just make it touchscreen. Yeah, option. I would prefer. Touch but screen. honestly, if they had to make the touchscreen option, you see how far back this is. Yeah, so they would have they to, would have to re, whole, yeah. They would have to redesign the whole. Yeah, they would. So, it's like I said, this screen, guys, is still super nice if you see it in person i'm pretty sure it looks even better because the colors the purple is vibrant at nighttime i'm pretty sure but speaking of luxury going out here they keep a nice touch with this actually like timeless <laughs> clock here it's, it's like a nice wrong. you can it's like a nice <laughs> rolex type thing so that actually it looks i don't know it just gives like a nice touch to the car like a very classic touch like to it. the car so moving out here you have your you can still see you have your dual climate control so this i haven't missed it so it's just you swipe yeah, up so or? you can um either swipe up to turn uh, it up okay down. Swipe. if you do dual whatever i choose on this side right, um AC. then i can i can control either both sides or just my side oh this is very yeah, basic easy yeah, layout nothing yeah. too confusing yeah like i said but i love the slide feature it's yeah. pretty cool and i'm actually hot so we're gonna check it out here. got you got you no <laughs> so, worries so you got a cd player here uh um, i do not own any cd i know nobody is that owns crazy? cd that is crazy no one owns cd anymore <laughs> my truck actually has a cd player as well nice but i, I don't honestly I, don't, I just bluetooth Take my yeah. phone to the Bluetooth and I Pandora or yeah. Spotify and just, you know, jam out in that way. So. I'm not sure why they're still putting CD players. But I see a lot of people still do it. I don't know why. I don't, I don't, I don't know. know nothing that comes on CD anymore that's a need. Yeah. I could be wrong. I don't know. True. But we'll move on along. So, again, so you got the heated cool seats here. We went over that. Uh, you know, just press them, boom, boom, different yep. levels. Yep. And then you go down here, you have your gear shifter wrapped in leather, of course. Well, actually, not always, but it has like a nice metallic and a leather wrap. I like yep. that. And it's small. It's yeah. kind of, which is cool. It fits your hand good, you know. I mean, my truck has a big bus of truck. You want a big bolster one, but this is actually cool. I like it. Yeah. It fits my hand. It fits, sticks with that whole smooth yeah. and sleek kind of. Right. Um, and especially for you, some, you don't want a big old. No, nah, I don't. Anyway. I need yeah, just, yeah. Just, just <laughs> I need good. <laughs> and then coming back here. You got your, I actually, this armrest, y'all probably can't see this, but it's one big 
piece. It's not like your a traditional armrest. So this don't really open. This one opens. Yeah, that one. Oh, that one opens. Don't okay. judge me. It's a little no, crazy in there. Okay, so that's still pretty cool. It kind of blends like almost into yeah. one big console. Yeah. I like that. And one of the cool features that they do have is, you know, since I'm not native to Texas, mm -hmm. um, I don't know what it is, but the weather here is kind of crazy. Yeah. And so I developed. Okay. So one of the biggest yep. things that I love about this vehicle is that um, there is a um, kind of like an allergen uh, setting oh, yeah, yeah, that the, I can uh, do. The uh, the like clear the air filter. Like, yes. Yeah. So it's, I just go to this option and then it starts to bring in. You can hear. I don't know if oh, you guys yeah, can hear it, but. Oh. And so it's filtering out the air, cleaning the air. Oh, wow. And I always feel better. Dude, now, that's pretty cool. I'm I thought lie. it was dope. I'm like, well, you can clean the air in my car. Let's do it. <laughs> that's pretty cool. So basically, it cleans and blows in fresh, clean air. You can hear it. I can hear it. That's pretty cool. I don't know any other car that has it. Then coming down here again, so you got eco mode and yep. like push to go to the sport, right? Yeah, that's if you're I mean, like normal. if you're if you're already in. So it's really a twist. Oh, sorry. So, no, you So um, you can see here on the dash, it'll yep. change. I can push for normal. Oh, okay. Do it. I can go then. to eco mode. Oh, ah, okay. Um. And again, if it's you, just a dial. Okay. So you can turn. So if I'm like, if I know I'm getting on the highway, yeah. And I kind of want need to like squall <laughs> out on somebody. Yeah, I, I just know. Eh, sport mode. Yeah, we're done. So. All right. You're moving on down, you got the trash control on yep. and off, and yep. then you got snow mode. That's yep. pretty cool that it's going to have snow yep. mode. And so one of the features that I do uh -huh. love, and again, this is my first brand spanking new vehicle, first mm -hmm. vehicle that I've ever, like, customly, you know, got to choose what I wanted inside. Yeah. I've never had a car with a sunroof. I know that's crazy. Oh, yeah. So, so, but, so that's one of the things that I do sunroof, love. Go ahead, let it in. Yeah. <laughs> and so, so they have all I'm, the controls and stuff up here. So Just your basic sunroof controls, nothing, so you know, down. too crazy. So, but I actually noticed this on where it's kind of like the suede material. Yeah, on the top yeah, of the yeah. whole type yeah. ceiling, so like that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So, yeah, I think that's about it. We cover everything on the inside. Uh, again, nice touch on the steering wheel. See, it come with the sport right there. I think over the steering wheel. Actually, steering wheel is wrapped in leather. That's nice. It has it's leather in. I'm not sure what you call this material, sure but it's it's, it's wrapped in leather in. It's wrapped in this other material here, but it's pretty. Perforated. Yeah, perforated exactly. I do know it has the pedal shifters. I don't know oh, yeah, how to does. to utilize those. You don't? He does. I don't. We gonna so. learn today. You wanna learn today? I'll learn today. Right, gonna, real quick, so if you guys know how to use pedal shifters, I'm explaining real quick. So it's 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 simple, but not really. So basically, each gear has a certain range. Each gear, so each gear can only go so high. Okay. So if you're in first gear and you hit a car start making like, mm, okay. that basically means, hey, this gear has reached its limit. You need to go up to the second gear, the okay. next gear. And, and then, so up, it would be the plus. Yeah, so up okay. would be the plus. And then so you go to second, the third, the fourth. So that's basically simply how it works. Okay. Uh, you just need to make sure you're always in the right gear to keep the car moving. Because if you get if you max out a certain gear, the car is going to hit a max speed in that gear. And you can't go until you shift up to the next gear. Okay. So I will, we'll give it a try, see how it goes. We ain't gonna <laughs> break nothing. I know, wish, wish the luck, we ain't gonna break nothing. But so first we just just drive and just wanna tell her how she likes by that car drive and then we'll get into the pedal shifters. All right, so one thing I just remembered yeah. um, when you were doing like the whole little panel and all the buttons, uh -huh. At ASC, again, I'm not very good with acronyms. Yeah. But, I mean, I don't um, know what that mean right. We can go Somebody later. know. You know right. what that means? Comment <laughs> below know. what ASC means. You know what it means. So comment below. I know the fundamentals. <laughs> it makes, okay, so this is an F Sport. And, yep. you know, you feel good when your car sounds good. I don't right. have a very powerful engine in this vehicle. Yeah. One Durham but. wouldn't allow me to choose a powerful <laughs> engine. Um, they, it is available. Yeah. But um, this ASC allows me to, like, if I roll it up, mm -hmm. it makes the inside. When I step on the gas, yeah. I can hear the engine. It sounds like a like a real like sports car. Okay, so it turns like basically open like the baffles and makes it sound like a like the exhaust like, a little louder. Yeah, that, okay, okay. Which I'm looking for. That's cool. So I'll start with it low. Okay. And then let's see if we can like hear Tell the, the difference. difference. But actually, what she said about the engine size. So she has a V4 V4 with twin turbos. So this car is actually pretty quick. Twin turbos. If y'all don't know, turbos are the future. That's where we going. So. But so actually, with the ten turbos, it might be quicker than what you think it is. Yeah, he just wouldn't let me get he it. He wouldn't let you get it. <laughs> so driving this car, I can tell you. So I just actually did the Honda Civic, the Honda Accord. This sits more on top. The Honda Accord sits. You're sitting in the car. It's a weird feeling. It's di very different. But this is very. You're more on top of the car. Is what I noticed. So how do you like driving this car? What do you? What do you so I feel like this car. I'm the type of person. I like a car that fits my personality. Okay. Um, that was one of the biggest reasons why I chose this car. I felt that it really personified who I am yeah. at this point in my life. Yeah. Um, just the look and all the, you know, the gadgets and stuff is 
it's great but um this was like a big mar mile marker for me to be mm -hmm. able to like afford a lexus i you know i went from driving you know a kia and nothing <laughs> against you know anyone with the kia yeah. um i had a sportage I'm, i was a single mom uh, um so it, it worked for me it worked right. for my lifestyle um but yeah. i just wanted something a little sexier and yeah. so you know there's a ton of cars that you can choose from i just feel like lexus is a luxury brand and so to be able to afford something like that um, which is really big for me. So I was just super excited. And then again, I'd, like I said before, mm -hmm. this is my first brand new vehicle. First time that I've ever gotten to actually choose everything that I wanted yeah. in a car. And I'm not like a huge car buff or like, you know, know all of the technical terms. Mm -hmm. I just know if it looks pretty and it functions <laughs> it's how it's supposed to. Good, right? Yeah, I'm good. So, yeah. you know, um, it's a smooth ride. I like the fact that I can go into F Sport and go fast. Yeah. Um, I like that when I pull up, it turns heads. Yeah, it um, definitely does that. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah I, I love my car. Okay, she, so she loves the car. I'm not going to lie, and I like this, too. Um, like I said, Lexus, what they're doing, of course, Lexus is a uh, very well-established brand. Everybody knows Lexus. And good quality vehicles. You get a Lexus, you can't go wrong getting a Lexus, right. you know, so ain't nothing bad about that. And also, I just noticed over here, you got uh, blind spot monitoring. Yep. I just saw the lights go off. The so. orange little, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I could use it in my truck, I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> yeah, you got a big shit. boy. Yeah, I know, I can't see nothing. People be running over, but, uh, so let's see, we're in Let eco mode. You want to try the oh, yeah. uh, ASC? Put it in sport mode. Sport second. mode? All right. So we flipping over sport mode. I guess, oh. <laughs> yeah, I felt the change. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, let's yeah, go. Yeah, it is. And so if you put it, can you mess with the ASC now? Yeah. Or wait till you get um, I don't want to, let me get through this little area. Okay, yeah. Like the police like to duck off in these neighborhoods. Okay, I got and you. And your girl does not want to get a ticket on yeah, camera. I am with you on that. <laughs> <laughs> but I was fine down here. Oh, really? Yeah, no. This area, be careful. It's like a speed trap. Man, I was flying. It's quick, though. Oh, I can't hear it. Maybe oh, it's just okay. when I'm on the highway. I, I heard something. Then I heard a little more noise. I'm not sure if that's just me, but I definitely heard a little more noise. Let me show y'all. Y'all see red back there. Look, so. Look, I need you want me to put this on chair? Yeah, put it down. You're lying. Oh, snap. I know that. <laughs> Look at red back there, man. <laughs> so you also got the the net. Y'all saw that it goes down and back. Sun the sun sun shade. I guess you want to yeah, call sunshade. it. Yeah, sun shade. I got that for um. I have a, a little one. Well, I guess he's not that little. No, he's eleven. He'll be no, twelve. Ty about to be a teenager, man. He ain't your baby no more. Ty, let him grow up. <laughs> well, I got that for him because we're in Texas yeah. and in the summer I want the little shade so his little neck and head ain't burning up. Oh, it is. <laughs> No, it's definitely louder. Right, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> uh, no, it's definitely loud. I definitely can tell the difference. That should sound good, man. I like I the way that sounds. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. one more time, y'all. Y'all ready? One, two, Go. three. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, you definitely can hear this out. Yeah. Definitely. I like that. Hey, that's a it makes plus in my yeah, book. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It makes you feel good. Put me back in my seat a little bit. It is quick, the turbo. You said one quick. This thing quick, man. It's quick for real. I very rarely do I get to put my foot in the gas. Yeah. So that was nice. You want to use pedal shelter? Yeah, so. Right, so. Kick it over, man. You can do it right now. Kick it over. All right, so you. Oh. How do I know when to go up? You hear the engine? Yes. Uh, take it up. Oh, there uh, you go. Boom. Now oh, you're third. Yeah, it. there you go. You're third. So you see the third? Yeah. And so now you can click up one more if you want to. You got a four. Yeah, you can go all the way up to fifth and six if you want to. You don't really have to be in a certain year. So, and then what, what, so when I would go down, what so, yeah. does that happen? So to watch, do? if you drop it down, your RPM goes, it's basically put the car in its power band. So it's going to feel, you're going to feel like you're in the fastest. So drop it down, hit the minus, watch it. Drop three. You feel oh, it? Snap. Like it's ready to take off. And so if you hit again the two, yeah. So that's how you do it. And then you can go back up the four. Yeah, there you go. Snap. Oh, yeah. Oh, y'all have to tell me something. <laughs> Wait, I'm about so, to play with this. <laughs> so let's say if you want to, let's say you wanna, you're want you in a tight spot, you want to take off. So yeah. drop it down to two real quick. You hear boom, drop it down one more. See how it's all the way up? Now you just take off, hit the gas. Yeah, yeah, and then go up. I have a sports yeah. car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, you go up again to five if you want to. Yeah, so it's, it's tamed. No. So basically it tames it down. So if you want to go fast, you're in the lower gear, high RPM. If you want to go slow, you're in the high gear, lower Ooh, RPM. Yeah, 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 yeah. We out here, look, hey, we out here getting it, baby, Q-tip. <laughs> that is 
dope. Yeah, so, and then you want to kick it out, man, you just knock that back over the drive. drive. Yeah. And Boom. now I'm like back to normal. Yeah, so. Okay, so I can only do pedal shippers when Thailand is yeah. not in the yeah. car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, Mom, what are you doing? I know, right? <laughs> like, put your seatbelt on. I the like back. the way that dude yeah. was. Yeah. I'm going to go ham in it. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, that dope. was awesome. That was. So today, I yeah, learned how she to learned use how to use pedal shifters. And you know, we'll do it more often. <laughs> you want to do it right awesome. here? Pedal yeah. shifters, watch it. So flip it over the manual. So with things, the pedal shifters too, you can control how high you want your RPM. When I say RPM, that's 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. Oh, got you, got six. you, got so you. So red is where your car red lines. That means you need to go up, finally. Okay. So you can hold this gear all the way up to like 6,000 before you need to shift it up. Okay. So it just gives you more control of when you want the car to shift. Okay. Gas. Yeah. So and you then do I shift I shift up? Yep, you shift up. So when you're here, you okay, I need to go up again. Okay. <laughs> I'm just like, I know, you gotta but check we gotta be checking around. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I've gotten myself out of a couple of tickets, so hey. I think that we could, you know. Oh yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna just we can jump make out. it happen. Ooh, that's no, CTS is nice. Hit it. Ooh, shift up, shift up, shift up. Yeah. There you go. Shift up. Yeah. <laughs> Right now, if I shift down. Now slow down, then shift down at the same time. So slow down. Oh. Yeah, there oh, you go. Yeah, awesome. yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh, yeah, so yeah, you start yeah. slowing down, you can start slowly shifting down. So as you slow down, shift down. Okay. Yeah. Oh, Give it a look. Yeah. Awesome. Make it all across the street. There you go. Then shift down again. One. Yeah, there you go. Oh, so that was a little too early shift. But yeah, that's how you do it. So you can kick it back over and drive. But yeah, oh, she's going to do it again. Yeah. Okay, we going again. <laughs> shift. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. Boom, yeah. So All you can right, just stay so in fourth gear and just let it go. Slow down. Okay, you can stay in fourth okay, and just slow down. Okay, yeah. We don't want to get too busy. Yeah. Way, back, he there. Way, he back, way there. back there. Come oh, on, Red. He's he embarrassing me. No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he's cautious. Uh, yeah, so, and then you can go up to fifth gear. How many gears you got? Just clear it all the way up. Okay. Keep going. All the way up. Five, six, six, seven. Oh, so you got an A speed. Seven is the highest. Seven is high. So, yeah, yeah, you can ride in seven gear. But you no, know, if you try to take off, Try to hit the gas, it's gonna be real sluggish. Oh, yeah, yeah you see yeah. that. But if you it drop it do. down and hit it, drop it down like two. Oh, sorry, we can turn, yeah, sorry. We turn it, yeah, yeah, sorry. But if you drop it down to two, you'll get that instant power. Nice, yeah, so I there you go. Really, really like yeah, that. Yeah, so you can just switch it back over. Yeah, I like the way this car sounds. It's four mode. I mean, I like the way this whole thing. Yeah, I'm shocked how fast it sounds. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I'm excited. It sounds powerful. <laughs> yeah, it does sound. It sounds it's. The way it sounds is hitting you shift through the gears. Yeah. That was fun for me. And oh. it's still like a smooth ride. Yeah, it yeah, it wouldn't. The yeah. Thing. So what do you think about learning how to do that for the first time? Um, that was pretty exciting. Yeah, well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely going to uh, use my pedal shifters more often. Um, very cool feature. Yeah. And I mean, it's it's cool because it's something that I hadn't ever used before right, or done right. before. Yeah. It just kind of puts a you know another spin to mm -hmm. you know why I love my car. Mm -hmm. So I hope y'all enjoyed that video. Yes. That's all I got. Again, that was Keith. Thank you for letting us come Absolutely. along into the car. Absolutely. Um, if you like this video, make sure you go ahead and hit the thumbs up. If you like the content you're seeing, make sure you consider subscribing, going back and browse some other videos. Absolutely. But that's all we got, man. Again, thank y'all for joining in. Say bye to the Nikita. Y'all probably see another video sometime. But that's all I got. Catch y'all next one. Y'all have the best day.